Geachte aanwezige burgemeester van de Utrechtse Hulverug, dames en heren en jongens en meisjes van harte welkom op dit concert van het 65-jarige herdenking van de bevereniging van Nederland door de harmonie van Eendracht Maak Macht in samenwerking met andere uitvoerenden die u gedurende deze avond nog te zien en te horen zult krijgen. Good evening, Mayor of Utrechtse Heuvelrug, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, a heartfelt welcome to the liberation of the Netherlands 65th year Remembrance Concert, presented by the band Eendracht Maakt Macht and other participants that you will be seeing and hearing this evening. <laughs>
continue our musical program, I would like to now to invite Mr. Naves, Mayor of Utrecht's Heuvelrug, to come on stage. This week, we commemorate the offers the Allies suffered to achieve this during the Second World War. I am happy that we are able to greet you tonight as our liberators. It's perhaps also the last time that you crossed the ocean as veteran. During this period, everywhere in the Netherlands, veterans of war are being treated as heroes. But herewith, also mixed feelings occur. On one side, there is joy about the fact that thanks, you, that thanks to your efforts, West Europe was liberated. I hope you enjoy this evening and God bless you. The mayor is now going to present medals to the veterans. Will you please come forward when your name is called? Howard Sinclair Anderson. William Bartlett. Alfred Hebbs. Mr. Frederick Hoyt. Mr. Norman Lawton. Mr. Henry Foster McKinnon. Mr. Elwood McLaughlin. Mr. John Duggle McMurphy. Mr. John A. Perot. Mr. Willis Randall Royal. Mr. Edward Saunders. Mr. Frank Schmidt. Mr. George Donald Sukowski. Mr. Alfred Weeks. The medal awarded to John Albert Belfry will be received by Linda Evans and Donna Barrett. The medal awarded to Ross James Bell will be received by Jennifer Graham. The medal awarded to William Harvey Birchill will be received by Joy Kelly. The medal awarded to Emerson Burnett will be received by Katie Harrison. The medal awarded to Chamberlain Lloyd Cochrane will be received by Michelle Rusk. The medal awarded to John William Collins will be received by Nancy Collins. The medal awarded to Daniel H. Evans will be received by Daniel and Sharon Evans. The medal awarded to Arthur James Foley will be received by Blair Foley. The medal awarded to Jack Hallam will be received by Don Hallam. The medal awarded to Alfred Tozer will be received by John Tozer. The medal awarded to David Ernest Graham will be received by Brent and Bill Graham.
The medal awarded to Alan Bill Hall will be received by Nancy Hall. The medal awarded to Oval Harrison will be received by Krista Harrison. The medal awarded to George Melwell House will be received by Nancy Davies and Peggy Harris. The medal awarded to Harold Arthur Henderson will be received by Marnie Strong. The medal awarded to Bruce Ellis Hutchison will be received by Judith Tate. The medal awarded to Andrew Kelly will be received by Patricia Van Heerde. The next two medals are awarded to Kenneth Little and Walter Carlyle Little, and both will be received by Marnie Strong. Two medals. The medal awarded to Clark Duncan Morrison will be received by Larry Morphy. The medal awarded to Clifford E. Murch will be received by Jean Murch. The medal awarded to Merlin Ross Mozilowski will be received by Kenneth Mozilowski. The medal awarded to Robert Griffith Partridge will be received by Judith Date. The medal awarded to Arthur Richard Stanbury will be received by Alex McCullough. The medal awarded to Ernest Strawn Winter will be received by Nancy Davis and Peggy Hyles. There is a medal uh, awarded to, uh, uh, I think, Mr. Vic Thorne who hasn't had a medal yet, Mr. Vic Thorne. There's a pin uh, awarded um, uh, to uh, CFS Giro, and it will be received by Dan LeBlanc. Last in this long line is Mr. John Jardin, who is awarded the pin, and it will be received by Heather Sheffield.